vapers, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about the UL Iron Fist. Alright guys, yes, today I'm taking a look at the Iron Fist by UL. This does come in a couple different colors, including this purple, comes in black, white, blue, yellow, red, orange, and green. And it also has three different types of leather grip. This snake skin that you see here, a crocodile skin pattern, and a pearled pattern, which they call it pearled, but it's actually, if you're like a leather person, you know it's called pebbled, and just technicalities. So it does come in a variety of different colors with different textures for the grip, but let's grab down close I'll show you what the kit comes with and how to work the device. All right guys here's the packaging that the UL Iron Fist comes in. It has what's in the box, specifications, specifications for the Crown 3, legal disclaimer warning, customer service information, and an authenticity code here at the top. Go ahead and open it up. Right on top we have the Iron Fist user's manual, a do not eat packet, a warning card about vaping and the regulations of vaping. And we have the mod, the tank, and an extra glass piece. But in this box we have some accessories. We have a micro USB to USB cord, a package of extra O-rings and a gasket, a drip tip dust cover, and an extra coil here. This is a plug and pull coil as you can tell. This one is a 0.4 ohm canthal coil, good between 50 and 65 watts. We have an extra quartz glass in here for the tank, but I'm going to keep it in this packaging until it's needed. It comes with a beautiful Crown 3 atomizer. This is a 24.5 five millimeter base 510 pin 62.7 millimeters tall and it holds five mils of e-liquid to change the coil you just spin off the airflow base and pull out the coil like so. Now this is a 0.25 ohm SUS 316 coil, good for 80 to 90 watts. We have airflow slots at the bottom that are on a stopper and a removable drip tip that is really actually super pretty. To fill up the crown three, you just spin off the top and you fill in either of these side ports, avoiding the center. And here is the Iron Fist mod. I do have the snake skin version for the grip here. At the top, we have a 510 connection that is stainless steel threads. You can see it says Iron Fist here. At the bottom, we do have an on and off switch. So it's not a five click to the fire button or anything. It's just an on and off switch. But to turn it on, you have to have dual 18650s in here, and you can see the battery contact, as well as which direction to install your batteries, and down there you can see it as well. So let's go ahead and put two 18650 batteries in there. So this mod is 86.5 millimeters tall by 56.5 millimeters by 28.4 millimeters. It is a zinc alloy leather stainless steel and quartz glass construction for the entire kit. This does go from 5 to 200 watts. So we do have the fire button, of course, the up and down regulatory buttons, the micro USB port. You can charge through here, but I recommend using an external charging bay. We have an LED screen right here that will display all the information. But before I get too far into that, let's go ahead and fill up this Crown 3. And today, of course, I filled mine up with some Bonsai Vapor Seasons. This is their winter line, and it is Summit's Kiss. You can use my code TIA20 for 20% off your order or 20% off anything on Bonsai Vapor's website, any flavor. All right, so I got the e-liquid in there. I'm gonna put it on top of this bad boy. And there we go. Look at that, that is such a nice, and I'm not even usually a purple fan, but that is pretty, oh, you can see it says you will here. So to turn it on, I was almost gonna use the fire button, but you just use the flicking switch at the bottom. The screen reads you will. Now we have the power level as well as the power mode, 80 watts, the working voltage, the battery life of both batteries, the ohms of the atomizer, a seconds counter, and it is in power mode, AKA watt mode. It does have temperature control for nickel, titanium, stainless steel, and a bypass mode as well. To adjust the power level, you just use the up and down buttons. They adjust by one watt increments. And like I said, this goes from five all the way up to 200 watts. When you hold down the button, it toggles through fast and goes to 200. Then it round robins back to five. You see that? So the fire button obviously fires the device, but if you click the fire button three times, 
the pow for power starts flashing and you use the regulatory buttons you can go into mech mode stainless steel mode for temperature ti which is titanium mode for temperature nickel mode for temperature and back to power mode so let's say we want to go to temperature mode then you press the fire button to select but you want to change to fahrenheit it just round robins from 100 degrees celsius if you push it down it doesn't go any lower than 100 degrees celsius it rotates back to the highest fahrenheit which is 600 and the lowest fahrenheit would be 200 so you get to 200 degrees fahrenheit and it round robins to the highest celsius which is 315. we'll go back to power because i like me some wattage mode super simple setup if you press and hold the plus and minus buttons at the same time you will key lock the device so you cannot adjust the wattage and you cannot fire it either. Press and hold those buttons again to unlock. Holding the minus button and the fire button at the same time will flip your screen for left or right handed vapors. To reset the device, which I don't want to do right now, but it's super easy. You just press the plus button and the fire button for more than three seconds and it will read factory reset on the screen if you need to do so. So it's really simple and easy to use this device. Now let's take it back up to FaceTime and have a vape. Let's have a vape, shall we? So that was the Iron Fist. It does have a few protection features, which you guys know I love. It has resistance detection, low power detection, protection, temperature protection, and reversed battery protection. Now, let's get a special guest on here to try out this sucker. All right, guys, surprise or not, it's Amanda again here to help me test out the Iron Fist. Yes, this is called the Iron Fist. The Iron Fist. By you well. Now, this I feel is- I like that's so naughty. <laughs> Why? <laughs> uh, the Iron a Fist this. <laughs> lot bigger than the things that you have tried this past week. But um, I wanted, you know, you to get the, kind of the full spectrum. So you can try the pod mods, then you can try the big boys. Just to see, like, maybe this is, like, a... Maybe know, more. I might like it more. Yeah, who knows? So why don't you give it a whirl? You press that button while you inhale. It's going to really it's gonna give, give you a lot me. of vapor. It's yeah, iron fist it to me. Perfect. It really is. And if it's not too bad, we can take it up because I did start it low. Oh no, that's good. It's got cake in it. Yeah. Dang, I like that. That tastes good. Thanks. Really smooth. Mm-hmm. Um, how is it like, because this can produce huge clouds. I noticed you're doing like little clouds, which is fine because you're, you're new, but is it, are you doing like smaller ones because it's overwhelming or you don't know like your limit yet? I'm just scared. Yeah. I'm just, <laughs> yeah. I'm just that girl. I'm just going to take a little bit. But it's way heavier though, don't you think? I think that device is really heavy. And I don't know, I don't think I would recommend it to a beginner. Yeah, you can get your workout. Freaking reps in. See, that was a good cloud. Yeah, and that, that wasn't that bad. I wasn't, you gave me some inspiration not to be a little bitch about it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Dang. That's pretty good. How was that though? I didn't choke. That's what I was scared of. Yeah. I don't know why I was being so scared about it. Well, it happens. It happens. But yeah, this is really heavy. Yeah, I yeah. know. Yeah. I should switch arms. <laughs> Me. Yeah, it does have two uh, 18650 batteries in it, so they're, they're really big batteries. That's, I like this. This flavor is really good. This burns it really good. It vapes it really good. Do you think... For you personally, do you like what we tried earlier this week or something that gives you that kind of power or yeah, I like well, either or whatever I you guess, think. I guess I like the, the first one, the kilo, the one kilo. Mm -hmm. I like that because that would be nice when we're out and about. Mm -hmm. I guess at home I would probably like this more. <laughs> she's not even vaping yet and she's like, I gotta have one for going out, gotta have one for home. That's a true vapor right there. Hey, okay, I gotta get rid of the cigarettes somehow. We have our And if rotation. I just like to smoke, like I just, I just like it. I don't know. I guess that's me. Yeah, and that can probably just, you know, the one, like the little one that you tried can fulfill your like hand and mouth. Where yeah. this is more like the visual, the cloud, the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dang. That's pretty good though. I'm impressed. I'm impressed for a noob that you can do such a big cloud without hacking. Like you said, like yeah, um, most of the time, like 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 I said, like in the first the first week, mm -hmm. I was like those ones you get from the stores. They just 
That's no good. You like really have to just go buy the real stuff. And I guess I better. like it. I, if I was going out with the girls, I might take this because it's pretty badass looking. You think so? It's like a dragon. Right. I'm scales, like scales, purple. I'm more personally all about like compact devices. So oh, yeah. if I had to choose between that or like the little pink one that you tried, I would choose the pink one because that's it's just so big. It's big and yeah. bulky. I don't want to take it anywhere. <laughs> hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Thank you again yeah, for being so my welcome. special guest all this week. It was really fun and I'm really excited to help you hopefully make the switch, find something that's right for you. And you guys give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. All right. Bye. All right, so that was the Iron Fist and my special guest testing it out for you guys. I hope you enjoyed. I will leave a link below to where you can check this out. I don't know if it's available yet, but it might be by the time this video goes up. But by the time I'm filming it, I'm not sure if it's available, but you can just check the description box below. I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts in the comments down below on the Iron Fist. And I do have one for a giveaway here, as well as several others for giveaways on my social medias. Hang on, I gotta put these down. So if you wanna win this one, all you have to do is check the description box below for the giveaway details. So that's it for the video and I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to this channel for more videos. Check the description box below for important links like where to get my favorite things like e-liquids, mods, etc. You can follow me on almost any social media site like Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, or Snapchat. All those social media links will be below. I also created a Patreon account where I do vape-related monthly rewards over there. I have eight different reward levels, so if that's something that might interest you, you can check the link below as well. And one more thing before you go, if vaping is something you're passionate about, please Please learn how you can fight for your right to vape. So as always, I'm Tia and thank you so much for watching.